There is no charge for awesomeness. G'day everybody, it's Guru Bob and welcome to day 11 of the 30 day challenge. By now you should have watched a video from Caro showing you how to create a Squidoo lens optimized for your target keyword in your niche. You probably noticed on that video that Caro mentioned that you can, you can add an RSS feed uh, to a Squidoo lens where that RSS feed uh, is optimized for your specific keyword. When you open up your Market Samurai today, you'll notice that you have a new version of Market Samurai. And in that new version, under the Find Content module, you'll see that there's some new content sources, plus the ability to create uh, an RSS feed specifically related to your keyword, which you'll be able to use um, in Squidoo and possibly in other Web 2.0 sites that we will focus on in the next few days. And later on in the challenge, you'll be able to use that RSS feed on your blog as well. So let's take a look. OK, I've already updated my Market Samurai. I'm looking at my target free key phrase here, Vintage Guitar, so I'm going to go into Find Content. And now you'll see that there's a number of new sources of content um, in this module. We've added Wikipedia to the Articles section. We've added YouTube and Flickr in a new Pictures and Videos area. And we've added a whole new section um, called News and Miscellaneous, where you can uh, search Scribed, Google News, Yahoo News, and Yahoo Answers. So how might we use this? Well, let's say, for instance, we wanted to create a keyword-specific uh, RSS feed for use in, let's say, Squidoo. Well, we, and we might want to have a look at, say, Yahoo uh, to see um, what, what sort of content we can find by doing a keyword-specific search in Yahoo. I've, I've asked for a number of results, 10, so that will bring back 10 results in the feed. And you can see that the current search shows that there are five items in Yahoo News at the moment. If I click the down arrow, then it gives me an indication of what those items are. Now in this particular case, I don't see any really specific information here about vintage guitar, so I might decide to move on and use a, a different feed. I'm going to turn off Yahoo News and turn on Yahoo Answers and see what that brings back. You can see that there's a lot more content now um, in Yahoo Answers around vintage guitar. And indeed, there's a lot of questions in relation to vintage guitars here in Yahoo Answers. And just like in, um, with the articles and the blogs, we can analyze these individual uh, Yahoo answers here uh, to see how many times that content may have been indexed in Google and whether the, that particular Yahoo, uh, Yahoo question and answer has, been, has any page rank or somebody's backlinked that. But um, at this stage, we're less interested probably in that and more interested in how we can find the feed, the RSS feed, for that particular keyword search on Yahoo Answers. And you'll see that now that next to all of the, the content sources, there is an icon here, which is uh, an RSS icon. And when you click on that icon, it copies the feed search URL into the clipboard. And you can see that this, this here is the, is the specific feed that has been generated in order to do that search. Once we've got that feed, um, on the clipboard, we can then copy and paste that um, in various places where we where we're able to actually submit RSS feeds. Like, for instance, when you're adding an RSS module into your Squidoo lens. Okay, this was always going to be a fairly quick video. All I wanted to show is that now you can search more content platforms using the um, Market Summary Find Content module, and then having done those searches, you can now generate specific RSS feeds from those platforms in relation to your, your key phrase. Hope you had a great day, rest day yesterday and you've caught up and you've, you're starting to get your head around um, what we're trying to achieve here in the 30 day challenge. Good luck for week two. We're now beginning the promotion phase of our uh, 
uh, or our efforts in the 30 day challenge. I look forward to hearing some hopefully success stories as we go forward. Talk soon. There is no charge for awesomeness.